Hi, it's DJ Talent, and I want to talk about meeting Simon Cowell. It was an amazing experience, a great experience, and it was a good thing. Um, okay, so I did the Jeremy Carl show in 2005, and um, it was really, really interesting. Like I made the Jeremy Carl show, and the production team said to me, you know, would you be interested in doing shows like The X Factor and things like that? And I'm like, well, I never thought of it at the time, really, you know. So I was in the, I, fi I finished making the Jeremy Carl show and I was in the green room at ITV television studios and people said, oh, you should, you should do like the X Factor and shows like, like this. And I, at the time I didn't really think about it, you know, but um, after I did the Jeremy Carl show, I went to, um, to, to Las Vegas and I was in um, the MGM Grand Hotel in Las Vegas and I was, um, I was near, I was kind of out and about. Uh, in the, chilling out in the swimming pools out in Las Vegas in the MGM Grand Hotel. And all these girls, were like women and ladies, were coming up to me saying to me, you, do, do you know Simon Cowell? Do you know Simon Cowell? He's really, really famous over here. And I said, um, and I said, yeah, yeah, well, yeah, yeah, for sure. Like, I, I know Simon Cowell. Yeah, of course. Like, he, he does the pop idol in England in the UK and stuff, you know. And... Um, I I I I said uh, and and there was a big hype in in Las Vegas like in the, in the MGM Grand at the swimming pool and people around the pool do you know Simon Cowell and I said I've just recently done a television show with Jeremy Cowell on ITV television but ultimately I'm I'm sure I'm going to meet Simon Cowell one day and our our paths are going to cross you know so ultimately I met Simon Cowell our paths crossed um, obviously in 2009 when I did Britain's Got Talent but it was. A bizarre experience you know obviously like when I'm in ITV studios in 2005 and I'm in the green room at ITV TV studios and uh, the people saying to me in the studio in the green room like would you, would you ever do the X Factor and stuff and then I'm in La Las Vegas um, in the MGM Grand Hotel um, in Nevada and, and people saying do you know Simon Cowell so it was an amazing experience. And meeting Simon Cowell, it was a great experience. It was a real amazing experience. It was good. And um, Simon Cowell was a really, really nice, genuine, nice guy. And when you're um, an artist for Simon Cowell and, and you tour and work on his show, he looks after you. So a lot of love and respect for Simon Cowell. It was great meeting Simon Cowell. And I thought, wow, you know, I did the Jeremy Cowell show. I'm out in um, Las Vegas the MGM Grand Hotel, there's a big hype about Simon Cowell and the pop idol and American Idol. Ultimately, now, you know, now I, now my, uh, my paths have crossed. I've, my paths have crossed with Simon Cowell. I've crossed paths with Simon Cowell. He's a really nice guy, a great guy, and I wish Simon Cowell all the best, you know. He's a really nice, genuine guy, and he really looked after me on Britain's Got Talent. So uh, meeting Simon Cowell was an amazing experience. You always kind of find when you see Simon Cowell in the studio and stuff, there's a presence around, man. Simon, you always feel a presence with Simon Cowell around, you know, there's a strong presence. But Simon Cowell's a really nice, genuine, nice person. And uh, yeah, he, I like his family shows like The X Factor and Britain's Got Talent. They're really, really great family shows. So uh, love and respect and world peace and best wishes to Simon Cowell. God bless, kind regards, best wishes, DJ Talent, peace.